What is up everyone, it's me Sivo. Today we are doing a very important um, economic uh, command. We are going to be doing withdraw and deposit. These are very simple to do, but I will show you how to do them. So basically, if you don't know what they do, which you, you should, but um, they take the money out and they put the money in your bank and wallet. So yeah, anyways, let's get uh, started. Make sure you subscribe though, because that would really help. All right, so first we're going to start with the deposit. By the way, doing the one after will be really quick because we can copy most of it. So first we're going to do at client dot command and then we're going to do async def and then we're going to do this deposit now what we're going to put inside is ctx i'm going to put in amount and we're going to make that an in and now we're going to just get out the normal database thing here oh uh, there we go what was uh and then um but instead we're going to do select everything so using asterisk select where your user id is and then we're going to call this data and then we're going to make a try statement so we're going to do try and we're going to call this one wallet is equal to data one as that as that's the second one in the in the freaking table and then uh, we're going to do bank equals data two and then we're just going to do accept so if there's an error we're just going to wait ctx.send there is an error but this will never happen well hopefully now if we do if um wallet is um because we want to deposit so if wallet is greater than the amount we're just going to do return away ctx.send oh you do not have enough and then we could just do an else so else we're going to do a cursor.execute so cursor.execute we're going to update our um our bank basically so update uh eco set bank equals question mark and then we're going to where so this is where we get the user id so it actually sets it where yours is, is and then we're going to do um bank plus amount yeah and then we're just going to put in our ctx dot id and that's pretty much it for that. Now we can actually just copy this real quick. Save so this time writing it. Now we've got to take away money from our wallet. So how you do this is wallet, take away amount. And we just got to change this to wallet. There we go. And now we can just send a message to a.ctx to send. And then we can just do, you have deposited. And then we can just put in the amount here into your bank into your bank and then um we just got the commit also db.commit and then uh cursor.close and db.close there we go and that should work that should be fine so but now we need to do a withdrawal so how we do this is we copy everything we just paste it down and then we just got to rename a few things so withdrawal and then uh blah, 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 blah. we change this to bank and then um, we we can just copy paste the second one here, delete it, and just put it on top. Just so it, I mean, you don't have to do that, but it just looks a bit nicer. Then we change this to plus, and that one to minus. And then we could change this to you have withdrawed the amount into your wallet. Uh, this has got a little error. Oh, that's why because I didn't. There we go. And that should be it for all of it. So now if we just play the bot. Did you see I was testing it? So if we look at our balance, we have got 100. So if we uh, deposit, say we want to deposit 50, it's going to... Okay, what happened? Oh, I'm so, I'm so stupid. So <laughs> so you see where it says user ID? I was going to do equal question mark. So um, just make sure you don't do that. I just got stupid with the silly syntax. But uh, yeah, just do that. There we go. And now it will work. All right, now if we do deposit 50, it's going to say you have deposited um, 50 into your bank. And if you do bow, it's going to see we've got a bank 50 and we've got a wallet. So now if we um, say we do deposit 60, it's going to say you do not have enough. And it as well won't put the money in your bank. If we do withdraw, so we want the money back. So withdraw this, withdraw 25. We have withdrawed and then we do bow. As you see, we've got 75 in our wallet now. And if we obviously withdraw more than we got, 
it's going to say you do not have enough. You can um, display these messages however you want, use embeds or whatever, but that is how you withdraw and deposit. So I hope you guys enjoyed, drop a like, and bye bye.